is up guys i am the infamous Fernay, back at it again being infamous in everything i do and welcome to episode four of the pokemon fire red randomizer nuzlocke series as promised i promised you guys yesterday that you guys will be getting this video you guys will be getting this series literally every day this week and i plan to keep that promise so if you guys are hyped that you're getting this video that you're getting this series Every day this week, if you guys are hyped that you're that I'm keeping my promise, and if you guys are hyped that your boy is happy today, be sure to fire punch that like button because it is greatly appreciated. And if you're new to my channel and want to join the fire punch community, the most hype, the most energetic, the most enigmatic, and craziest family on this platform. And want to become a fire puncher yourself be sure to fire punch the subscribe button down below also i upload videos every monday through friday and i go live on this channel every thursday and friday as well so if you want to be notified whenever i go live be sure to fire punch the bell icon right there beside the subscribe button and with that said let's jump right into the video if you guys missed the last episode i highly suggest you go check it out because in the last episode we managed to get through mount moon and get ourselves some encounters as well as take on a nugget bridge and battle our rival but in today's episode however we're going to be taking on misty yes i am not stuttering we will take on misty this video is probably going to be long as hell mostly because me and spencer weren't able to record soul link so i, I feel like i should make up for that with the long video in any way so in today's episode, we're gonna battle these trainers that you see, like this trainer right here that you see to my right. This trainer right here, this, this hiker, right there, right there. But we're gonna battle these trainers, get to Bill, talk to him, uh, get to Misty, take her on, which I'll get to that in a second, and then get on to Route 5 and get ourselves Route 5 encounter. So, without further ado, let's jump right into a powerful team recap. Starting off, the, starting off the powerful team recap. I can't speak today. I'm so giddy. I got the giggles, guys. Start, starting off the powerful team recap, we have Natsu the Growlithe, the starter Pokemon that you guys chose for me with the modest nature. That, did my voice just fucking crack? <laughs> what the hell is going on with me today? I don't know what's going on today, but we have Natsu the Growlithe, the starter Pokemon that you guys selected for me with the modest nature, holding the focus band, with the intimidate ability, and the moves, Bite, Roar, Ember, and Leer. Coming up next, we have Gajil the Metagross with the relaxed nature, holding the deep sea tooth, with the clear body ability, and the moves, take down, confusion, metal claw, and scary face. And I'd just like to point out, my window is currently open, guys. So you guys are going to hear some sounds, and I'm going to need everybody in the village right now. I'm going to need everybody in my apartment complex to please shut the hell up. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Yeah. Yeah, I'm recording. I'm, re I'm recording a YouTube video. Uh, it's Infamous Infernate. All right. Cool. Cool. Thank you. Th See, guys, this is why I love the people here. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. I'll see you there. Thanks. All right. <laughs> so somebody outside my window literally just said they will subscribe. Me. Thank you. Uh, I'm. Let's go. Let's freaking go. We got. Wait, wait. Did we already go over the move sets? We are. Yeah, we did. We wait. Did we? Take down confusion, metal claw, scary face. We 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 going over the abilities. All right, all right. Next up, we have Sleepy Be the Numble <laughs> with the basswood nature holding a poke it all. With the obliv oblivious ability and the moves, growl, tackle, and ember. Coming up next, we have Sebastian the Kingly with the sassy nature, holding a mystic water, with the hypercutter ability and the moves, bubble, leer, vice grip, and harden. Next up in the fifth slot, we have Manny the pillow swine, or pile swine, as some people like to say, with the relaxed nature, holding the shell shell, with the oblivious ability and the moves, horn attack, odor sleuth, powder snow, and endure. And finally, the newest addition to the team, we have Bo the Eevee 
with the calm nature, not holding an item, but with the runaway ability and the moves, tackle, tail whip, helping hand, and sand attack. And that is the team that we're rocking out with, and that is the team we're going to move forward with. So if you guys are ready for today's episode, be sure to fire push that like button, because it's going to be wild, guys. It's going to get wild. But let, let's just talk about how this person just literally, just like, she was loud as hell outside, and she like... I like said shut the hell up and she like looked up and she's like is you talking to me and I was like yeah yeah I mean you guys heard it all go down I mean I don't, I'm pre I don't know if you guys heard her or not I don't know if my mic is that powerful to pick her up but hey thank you for the support I mean let's go getting up there all right now no I'm not taking on a gym just yet actually what we could do what we could do is let's battle this first trainer right here let's battle this first trainer right here and see what we're looking at. Let's see what the levels we're looking at. Let's see what let's see what could possibly become this. Oh, a Grimer. All right, all right. A level 16 Grimer. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Natsu level 20. Good shit, good shit. That means that probably I want to say that Misty is probably going to have a level 20. Ace probably be level 21, maybe. So we definitely need to get up there in the levels. Probably get to level 25 with Natsu. Uh, maybe, maybe, hopefully she doesn't have, like, any water types, hopefully the randomizer didn't screw it. why? Why, game? Why must you do this to me? Why, why? I can't escape this mod, like, you guys know how I love Scizor, Scizor is my favorite bug, Scizor is my favorite bug, Mega, yada, 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 this pisses me off, I'm so tired of this, this always freaking happens. I'm so tired of this. Why is this constantly a thing? Why is this constantly a thing, Pokemon? Why must you always bring up my favorite mons to me for me to kill? Like, why? Why is this a thing? Why is this a thing? I, I can't believe that. Like, why? Why? I don't understand. Anyway, anyway, if you guys don't know, I used to... Oh wait, my first series on this channel was this fire red nuzlocke series not this run through but i did have a run through where we went through it three times in a row and all three times we got bodied and the final time we got bodied by misty and it was not a fun time it was not it was not a fun time whatsoever it wasn't like a, a walk in the park it wasn't a trip to the carnival it was none of that all right i didn't go to the carnival didn't get no funnel cake none of that i went to the fish marsh fi fish marsh it Fish mar yeah, yeah, fish marsh it. It's not market, it's marsh it. All right, I went to the fish marsh. <laughs> what the fuck am I saying? Anyway, we got straight up body by Misty, and I refuse to let that happen. I refuse to let that happen. Okay, and we got a Shedinja. I'm gonna get on this topic in a second as well. But I, I refuse to let that happen again. We will get vengeance, we will redeem ourselves, and I will not let it happen again. So, Misty. I'm coming for you. Eh? You ain't gonna beat me today. Best believe it. But now let's talk. Oh, that's a for alligator. I caught that. Okay, who's taking that? Gazio's gonna take that. But about the Sedinja. Fun tip, pro tip. If you guys wanna ever use a bro have a broken Shedinja, here's what you do, right? Here's what you do. You get a Shedinja, right? Catch it. Then, slap an Eviolite on it. Put a... Or, no, 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 not an Eviolite. Put a Focus Sash on it. Focus Sash, Focus Band, whichever one you want. Then, you teach it Endure, Protect, and Toxic. And there you go. That's how you get a broken Shedinja. Let's talk about this for a second. Why is that a thing? Think about that, okay? So, for one, you got Focus Sash, Focus Band, right? It's gonna live on one, it's gonna live any hit, all right? Then a Sedinja has Wonder Guard, so it's gonna live regardless unless the attack is super effective against it. Or it's a, or if it's a, uh, a KO move, right? Then, you have Endure or Protect, which will protect it for turns on end. Just alternate between the two, right? And then you have Toxic, the one move that can poison your opponent. All you have to do 
stall it out. And that's how you get a broken Shedinja. And we just bodied this trainer, by the way. We just straight up bodied this trainer. Let's take on this hiker down here. Let's go. Let's go. Anyway. Anyway. Today has been a really good day. I mean, I got, uh, I got notified that I wasn't going to be offered a summer position that I was trying to get. Um, which kind of sucks a little bit. Um, it kind of sucks. I was really relying on that so that I, uh, so that I could get my housing paid for and everything. And I didn't have, and I wouldn't have to pay out of pocket for it. Um, I don't know. I might have to pull out a loan or something like that. Or I might do a support stream. If you guys will be down for a support stream, definitely let me know in the comment section down below. I mean, uh, I would be down for it. I mean, your support right now is greatly appreciated. If you guys want to go the extra mile and support your boy, thank you so much for that. But what I think I might have to do is I might have to pull out a loan and uh, do that. Because your boy can't go home. I cannot go home. Uh, you guys are probably like, Infamous, Jerry, why can't you go home? It's because I have way too much shit. Alright, my house is small as hell. Me and my brother share a room. And our bedroom is small as hell. I have way too much stuff, and there's no way I can fit all my stuff in my van with my brother's stuff. I, there's no way. Alright. Bro Infamous is going home. Bro, uh, no, it's not Bro Infamous. You guys turned him as Bro Infamous. Bro Infamous is going home because it's his first year, and he just wants to go home. Um, he might not. He might stay next summer or whatever, but he definitely said he was going home this summer. Um, Bro Infamous is going home, so I decided, hey, what the hell. Go ahead. You go home. Take all your stuff, bro. And you can get the room to yourself this summer and everything. I'm going to stay here like I did last summer and uh, try to live. And right now, it's kind of looking iffy. Because my current job does not pay enough to actually help me out. Like, I'm going to be transparent with you guys. Um, I work with the, I work on the library. Like, I work in the library, like my on-campus library. And I, make, I, pay, I get paid minimum wage and I work... 12 hours a week uh, and then my boss pulled me aside and was like uh, asked me if I wanted to work this summer and I was like sure and he told yo it's oddish I'm sorry boy uh kind of have no choice here man love you though yo stay up bro stay cool stay cool um sorry love you Anyway, um, I get paid minimum wage, and that's not nearly enough to cover what it's going to cost me to stay on campus over the summer. So, I might have to pull out a loan. And that's going to actually suck, because I already own a sh I already owe a shit ton of money in loans. So, hopefully, this will be the last loan I have to take out. Um, I do know that if I take out this loan, I can definitely save up to, A, uh, eventually get a car... And B, pay for next semester. Without a doubt. Without a doubt. Because your boy didn't get any scholarships as well. Which is another thing. This school, I sometimes don't like this school. For the simple fact that... Actually, we need to stop training up not to and train up to someone else. Um, let's switch out. Let's go out to Manny and switch train real quick. Switch out to Manny. Oh, excuse me, guys. Switch out to Manny real quick and do some switch training. But, yeah, your boy's going to have to do something. He's going to have to pull some strings this summer. He's going to have to pull some strings. But, on a positive note, you guys will definitely be getting some new stuff this summer. And, by the way, as I said before, if we reach 100 subs before the one-year anniversary, July 20th, there will be a... Uh, I was about to say Soling. There will be a Pokemon Yellow Sleep Lock. That is right. I have settled on Pokemon Yellow. Shout out to Andreas for um, constantly pestering me about this. This boy would not shut up about Pokemon Yellow. It is one of his favorite games. And he asked me to do a Pokemon Yellow Sleep Lock. So what I'm going to probably do is I'm going to hit him up. And we're probably going to be in a Discord call. Uh, probably get a couple more of my friends to be in a Discord call with me. And who knows? There might be a face cam. There might be a face. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Not Tails has fl uh, flash fire. I need to switch out. I need to go out to Sebastian. That's who I need to go out to. Sebastian can take down his nine tails easily. Go out to Sebastian real quick. 
and use bubble. I can't wait for us to learn uh, either bubble beam or water gun. Uh, I need to look up these level up movesets so I can keep a track of uh, when Amon learns what. The Naito goes for Ember. We take a little bit of damage from it, like less than I thought we would, but we're living. We're living. We're out here living. We're going to go for that bubble, and it does a lot of damage. It doesn't do as much as I actually thought it was going to do, but it's okay. It's okay. As long as we don't get burned, we're good. We're cool. We're good. We're golden. All right. We're golden boys right now. We're golden boys. We're golden boys. But yeah, guys, I can't wait for the summer. The school year has been hectic. It's been throwing me all kinds of ways and stuff like that. And as soon as I say, uh, hopefully we don't get burned, we get burned. But this school year has definitely been throwing me every which direction. It's like you're in a whirlpool of just nonsense, you know. And it, I, I can't wait for it to be over. I can't wait to start a new year. New year, new me. Uh, some people used to say, new year, new me. When it comes to next year... Your boy is going to be in it to win it when it comes to the Dean's list. And yes, that is my goal. My goal is to make it to the Dean, is make it on the Dean's list. All right. This, okay. You need to chill. Don't hit yourself, Sebastian. Don't hit yourself, Sebastian. Sebastian. Sebastian's dead. Sebastian is going to die. Oh, thank you, Jesus. All right. Let's switch out. Let's switch out. Let's go back out to Natsu. Let's go back out to Natsu and we can go for a bite to kill this Nine Tails. Oh my god, that right there, that that was scary. That was scary. We need to make sure that we heal that uh, that burn and heal up. We need to make sure that we definitely do that. Alright, get out of here, Ninetales. Get out of here. Sebastian gets to level 16. Good job, buddy. A Masquerade. Who do we have for Masquerade? Who can we go out? We can go out to Gazio. We can go out to Gazio. We'll probably get Gazio up to level 20. Probably level 20. Not yet. I mean, he has three. This person has three more uh, Pokemon. So we can definitely get him up there. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Um, Let's go for Metal Claw. See how much that does. Let's see how much this do. Oh my god. All right, Godzilla. All right. Calm down, buddy. Calm down. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I mean, hey, you're out here now, man. Let's go. Let's get you to level 20, buddy. He's like thirsty. He's he's hungry for that level 20, yo. He's out here getting kills. Whew. Alaron. Let's stay in. Let's stay in. Actually, I probably could have switched out to Natsu. Actually, this would be a good... We could just switch train. That way... That way, Gazio doesn't get mad. That way, Gazio does not get mad. All right, Laron. What you got, boy? What you got? What you gonna do? Headbutt? Pfft, not doing a thing. Why did I go for bite? I meant to go for Ember. Why did I do that? I mean, I mean, this probably will be a one hit KO. This probably, this probably will finish it all. Bam, dead. God, damn, our team is stacked. Our team is really, truly stacked right now. Like, if we get ourselves, oh, oh wait, we have bite. We have bite. Are we battling our rival right now? This is, is this Nick? Is this Nick right now? Is this Nick? Big dog, is that you? Bam, dead. God, damn. Gengar got body. Shit. All right. <laughs> All right. All right. Now let's heal up our team. Let's heal up our team before we go any further and battle that trainer right there. We got eight super potions, ten potions. We need to use these wisely. Use these wisely. All right. Sebastian is healed all the way up. Do we have any burn heals? We do not. All right, let's heal. Wait, wait, wait. We still have to heal up. We still have to heal up not to. Let's go for a regular potion right now. Bam. There we go. All right, so Sebastian can't come out anymore. Oh, we didn't even battle that trainer. Oh, we need cut. Are you kidding me? That's so dumb. That's so dumb. Let's battle this trainer right here. Let's go ahead and battle you. See what you got. Yo, can this jet not? Can this jet right now? Oh, it's not a jet. It's a plane. All right. A Raichu? That's fine. We can go out to Sleepy B. Let's go out to Sleepy B. Yo, B. What you got on your plate? What you got on your plate, B? Goes for the quick attack. That quick, quick attack. Let's go for that Ember to take out this Raichu. Let's go for that quick old Ember. 
And the reason I'm not using speed up, guys, is because, as I said in the beginning of the episode, me and Spencer weren't able to record Soul Link today. So, in, um, in honor of that, um, taking place of that for today, this episode is going to be a long one because we're going to battle all these trainers, uh, battle or get Bill back to his normal self, battle Misty, and then we're going to get ourselves another encounter. So that's the, that's on the agenda for today. That is what we're going to get done today. All right, Sleepy B gets his first kill. A giraffe rig comes in. Yeah, we're going to switch back out. Let's go out to Let's go out to Natsu because uh, giraffe rig is a psychic type, right? It's normal psychic or just psychic. One of the two. Um and bite will kill it in an instant. Bite will definitely kill it in an instant. Let's fucking go. Yo, I need to text um I need to text Cryptic and see if he wants to do a, um, either an Evil Within stream or a Last of Us stream, because uh, me and him, ever since that last Outlast, ever since that Outlast playthrough, we have been dying to do another one. But Addison, aka Lil Rubble, me, act like he can't ever take off work. And keep in mind, guys, Addison is the manager of his job, and he never wants to take off. So, we're hoping that he's able to take off next Saturday so we can actually do Whistleblower and At Last 2 because we definitely want to finish out the series. We most definitely want to finish out the series. Alright, Natsu gets to level 23. Good shit, Natsu. Good shit. We out here. A Psyduck. Let's switch out because that is a water type. Fun fact. For you guys who don't know uh, Pokemon... Even though Psyduck has Psy in his name, he's not a Psychic type. Even though he can learn Psychic type moves. The more you know. The more you know. Let's take out this Psyduck with one hit. A critical Metal Claw. That's what I'm talking about, Gazio. Gazio, if you don't get to level 20, bro. Bro, Gazio's going to get pissed. Gazio is going to get pissed. Let's take on this trainer right here. Did we got those two trainers down there as well? Are they trainers? Are they trainers or, they, or are they just a couple looking over the water? Hmm. Question mark? Hmm. Thinking emoji? Let's take on this Gligar right here. Yo. Gliscor is probably one of, like, if, like, after Infamous, or uh, after Infernape and all of that. Like, after all the evolutions that were introduced in Gen 4 and stuff, Gliscor is probably one of my favorite mods. Just because of the anime. Just because of Ash's Gliscor. That, that mod right there... He was energetic as fuck. His, his, like, Ash's Gligar in Gliscor was energetic as hell. A uh, Gardevoir, yo. Yo, two Megas coming out. Two Megas? Mega Gardevoir, Mega Gazio? Yo, Spencer, I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry I have to do this, man. Sorry I have to do this to you, bro. Metal Claw to this Gardevoir. Can we get another crit, Gazio? that boy my boy out here getting them my, oh gotten them kills getting them kills boy let's go he gets to level 20 finally this boy was power this boy was hungry he was ready for that a porygon let's stay let's keep him in let's keep him in right now let's keep him in right now let's keep him in he traced our clear body we go for another metal claw and our attack has risen instant ko god damn guys yo out here getting kills bro who, who upset you, man? Who hurt you, man? Who hurt you? All right. Let's go talk to Bill. Bill, 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 Bill. No, nah, let's see this guy. <clears throat> Hiya. Wait, no, no, that's bad. <clears throat> Hiya. I'm a Pokemon. No, I'm not. Call me Bill. I'm a true blue Pokemon. Yet. Hey, what's with the skeptical look? I'm not jousting you, pal. I screwed up with an experiment and got combined with the Pokemon. So how about it? Help me out here? Wait till I get inside that teleporter. When I do, go to the PC and run to the cell separation system. Alright. Alright, we turn on the cell separation system. Yo, wait, wait, wait. So does that mean Gary didn't do anything about this? Like, was Bill already transformed into a Pokemon already, or did he not do anything about it? I mean, bro. Yeah, thanks, bud. I owe you one. I owe you one. 
So, did you come to see my Pokemon collection? You didn't? That's a bummer. I've got to thank you. Oh, sure. Maybe this will do. I don't know what voice I'm giving him, but it's fantastic. I'm laughing at it. That cruise ship SSN is in Vermilion City. Here. I, wait. Mm -hmm. I'm sure there's a lot of trainers on board, too. They invited me to their party, but I can't stand fancy dudes. Why don't you go instead of me? Go on and have a good time. Yee, doggy! Alright, I'm done with the voice. I'm done with the voice. Alright, hello there. Are you alone? If you're out if you're out at Cerulean Cape, well, it should be as a couple. Alright, alright. Good shit, good shit, good stuff. Alright, now let's run over here. Actually, we can just do this. We can just do this and avoid everything else. We battle every trainer over here. Got in as much experience as we can. Now let's take on the bitch that ended our fucking series the last time. I refuse to lose again. I absolutely refuse. I, I do not condone this. Alright, let's heal up our team first, though. Let's heal up our team first, because Sebastian is still burned. So, uh, wait, why the fuck am I going into Mart? I mean, I guess we can come up in here, but why the hell did I come in here? We gotta sell the nugget that we have. Go ahead and sell that. Get some straight up good cash. Alright, now let's buy some more super potions. Uh, 13 should be enough. Actually, that's all our money. That's all our money. Let's actually buy 9. Alright, we're good on all of that stuff. Let's buy some heal. Let's buy some burn heals. Two of those. Let's buy some awakenings. Let's buy three of those. Let's buy some more paralyzed heals, even though we got two in the bag. Let's buy four of those. Definitely got to stock up on some antidotes. Let's buy ten of these, or eight of these. Sorry. And, yeah, that's about it. That's all we need right now. Now let's go heal up our minds, and then we'll take on Misty. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Let's do this. I'm ready. I'm ready. If you guys are ready, I'm ready. Let's freaking go. I'm ready, Eddie, like SpongeBob said. I'm ready, Eddie, like SpongeBob said. And I think I'm going to extend the episode a little bit longer. So you guys are going to get an hour of power. An hour of power, guys. Are you guys ready for this? Let's freaking go. Let's go ahead and save our game just in case anything bad happens. Like it happened in the last episode where I accidentally reset it the wrong. Like, I still, to this day, don't know what button I press, what button combination I press to restart the emulator or restart the game. But let's go ahead and take on this trial, this trainer. I said trial trainer. This isn't Gen 7. This isn't freaking Obola. Which, by the way, was dumb. Like, I love the aspect of the trials and stuff like that, but I miss the gym battles. I definitely miss the gym battles. Weightlifter Jessica has one Pokemon and sends in a Noctowl. Girl, do you gotta? Oh God! Oh my God! This this is rookie train. This is a rookie trainer. Yo, did you guys just hear that car turn up? Come on, man! Come on! I'm up here recording, bro. Can you chill? Can you chill? We get the flinch on a knockdown. Get the flinch. Let's go for that ember. Let's see what else we can do. Keep getting it down there. All right, a bite probably will put it away. He goes for the hypnosis. Thank God we bought Awakening. Thank God we bought Awakening. Can we wake up right now? Alright, no. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. Not to take your time. Take your time. Just don't die. Just take your time. We got we got potions for days. We can heal up. Alright, not to wakes up. He had a good nap. The knockdown lives on one, but it is dead this turn. It probably should have went for growls while we were asleep. Probably would have lived that it probably would have lived a little bit longer. <laughs> Down goes the knocked out. Down goes weightlifter Jessica. And now it's time to take on this bitch. Let's fucking go. And you know, guys, you know that I need to stop calling her a bitch. She's not a bitch. She's just a Pokemon trainer out here trying to live her life. You know, she's a gym leader and all of that. She got to make money somehow. You know, she got to feed her sisters. So let's freaking do this. Mm. Oh my god, gotta get my Starbucks. Hi, you're a new face. Only those trainers who have a policy about Pokemon can turn pro. Who, wait, what is your approach when you catch and train Pokemon? My policy is an all-out offensive with Water-type Pokemon. You know what, Misty? That's good. Good for you. You have a policy. You have a policy. Alright. Chef Pie would like to battle. 
Sends out an artillery. Bro. Bro, what is this? What is it? I swear to God, if she has a legendary, I'm going to be pissed. If she has a legendary Pokemon, so help me God, I will probably throw my controller out my window. I will probably throw my controller out of my window if she has a legendary. Water gun, good thing we switched out. That was a definitely a good thing that we switched out. Let's go for the Metal Claw on this Octillery. See how much we can do to it. Not very effective. Didn't do a lot of damage like I thought it would. It keeps going for the Water Gun, but we're fine. Let's go for the Confusion just to see how much Confusion will do to it. Keep in mind that both Psychic and Steel moves are stabbed because of Gazio's dual typing. Confusion did a lot of damage, so we're just going to go ahead and go for it again and kill the Octillery. First Mon down, one more to go. What else you have? You have an Ekans! She's throwing! She's throwing! She's giving us the win! She gave us the win! Yo, G motherfucking G. Let's go. Let's go. Her ace was level 21. We had nothing to worry about. We had nothing to worry about. Let's freaking go. Let's chalk this up as a W. Let's chalk this up as a W. Go ahead. Get, you, you can paralyze me if you want. You can paralyze me if you want. Best believe it's not going to work. Best believe it's not going to work. Watch. Watch. Natsu's going to break through the paralysis. Get the kill. And that is a GG. Getting our second gym badge of the series. We're already out here. We already out here. Get 2100 from that. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. We don't even care about your dialogue anymore. Let's freaking go. We get TM03 from Misty. Willow Wisp. Willow freaking Wisp. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Now, I want to check something out real quick. Can we get a... Wait, we don't even have the fishing rod just yet, do we? No, we got to go back to... We got to go to Saffron City to get the... um To get the uh, fishing rod. We got to go to Saffron to get that. But I think what we're going to do to finish off the episode is get a couple more encounters, guys. So this episode is long from being over. This, long, this episode is long from being over. Although I will tell you guys, your boy's kind of hungry. Your boy is kind of hungry. Getting, them, getting really, really hungry over here. I don't know how many times I can say. <laughs> I need to stop. I need to stop. Yo, let's talk to this guy real quick. They stole my T. They stole your TM for guillotine? Yo? Bro? Hey, stay out. Of, stay out. It's not your yard. Huh? Me? I'm an innocent bystander. Don't you believe me? No, bro. You're wearing Team Rocket gear. Maybe if you were wearing, like, civilian clothing, maybe I would believe you. He brings in a Krabby. He brings in a Krabby. You know what we're about to do? You know what we're about to do, guys? You know what we're about to do. Let's do this. Sebastian, come on out. Come on out, buddy. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Vice Grip. Oh, it lives. Alright, Battle of the Vice Grips. Alright. Battle of the Vice Grips. GG. Critical hit. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Sebastian is out here. A Kabuto, let's stay in. Let's stay in. Sebastian, come on. It's your time to shine, boy. It's your time to shine. Let's go for another vice grip on this Kabuto. Oh my god, with the Chris. Double crit. Double crit. He goes for the Harden, so you already know we're about to switch over to Bubble. We already know we're about to switch over to that Bubble. And down goes the Kabuto. Oh wow, it lives. It lives. Yo, that's going to hurt. That's going to free. Oh, hey, wait. I mean, it didn't do as much as I thought it was going to do. Let's go for Vice Grip again. See how much that'll do. It does nothing. Literally nothing. All right. So this battle is going to take forever. This battle is going to take forever. But I hope you guys are having an amazing Wednesday. I hope you guys are enjoying this episode, this powerful hour of power that I'm throwing at you guys. So if you guys are enjoying this or you guys are having a happy day, let me know in the comment section down below hashtag happy days if you guys don't know that reference you guys got to check it out happy days is freaking good sunday monday happy days tuesday wednesday copyright let's i'm gonna stop right there but yo happy days was my stuff man 
And you guys were in free. I I was on a high horse and this fucking Kabuto killed that high horse. Like, just fucking die. I was over here having a good time, happy days all around. Bro, what in the absolute fuck? <sighs> Alright, but you know what this means, right? You already know what this means. Somebody's getting added to the team, and I think you guys know who. I think you guys know who's getting added to this team. The fan favorite, my boy, Double Staff, coming in. Let's fucking go. Let's go ahead, deposit. Seb, I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. But you guys already know what time it is. It's time for us to make a wish. With the wish maker, the number one, the one and the only wisher. Ooh, that that, that rolled off the tongue. Wisher. <laughs> Let's check out wisher stuff. Let's go. So we got a modest wisher. Hmm, interesting. Hold a TM45 with the serene grace ability and the moves wish, confusion, and rest. Hmm, if we can get sleep talk. We can get sleep talk. Let's take this away from Wisher. Check that out. Peep that. TM45. Let's go to our TM pouch or TM case. Check this out real quick. So we got guillotine and magic coat. Hmm. hmm. Interesting. We also still have a fossil. So maybe we can get another encounter as well with the fossil. However, that's long. That's later down the road with the fossil encounter. Let's go on all the way to Route 5 and get ourselves another Pokemon into the PC. Yo, and this series is already turning out better than I thought it would. What's over here? We got to cut that area. Can't get there. Can't get there. All right. Now, the question is, do I want to get one right here or one all the way down here? You know what? Let's do this. Let's do it. Let's get it. Let's get ourselves another encounter. Route 5. Let's pick this patch of grass. And our Route 5 encounter is... Yo! Oh! My boy! Yo. <laughs> we lose a Watermon, get a Water Ground type fully evolved. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. You already know it's time. You already know it's time. Let's go. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. How many Pokeballs do we have? We have 10 Pokeballs. Oh, fuck. Uh, fuck. We have no way to weaken this now. We have no... We gotta go out. We gotta switch out to Gazio. We gotta switch out to Gazio. I could go for Takedown. I could go for Takedown. Takedown shouldn't do a lot of damage to Swampert. But we're 8 levels above it. We're 8 levels above it. But it's, it's not Stab. I'm not risking it. I'm not risking it. Not no. I'm not. That that would definitely be a bad call. Yo, this is already a bad call because Godzilla is a steel type and Swampert's a ground type as well. So if it has a ground type move, we're fucked. We are fucked. And I kind of hate that Godzilla has clear body right now because if it was lowering our attack, I could definitely attack it with something. Yo, that was three. Yes. Let's fuck go. I said, let's fucking go. We got a Swampert. Swampert. I, I, I need to chill. I need to calm the fuck down. You already know what we're naming this boy. You already know we got to name it J-Dizzle. We got to name it J-D. Let's fucking go. J-D, shout out to the first part of the Pokemon Fire, or not Fire Red, Pokemon Heart Gold randomized Nuzlocke series. What else could we have ran into here? I swear to God, we run into like something like a Rayquaza. I swear to God, I'll be pissed.
<laughs> no! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you serious right now? That is so dumb. That is so fucking dumb. Like, I'm not mad that we got a Swampert, but a Groudon. A Groudon. I want you guys to know if this mine had been our first encounter and we would have caught this thing. I can guarantee you 100,000% that this mod would have came onto the team. 100,000%. Somebody was coming off for that, for that Groudon. Somebody was coming off. But you know, them was the Brex. Them the Brex. We can't really do much about it. Hi, do you have a Nita Reno? Want to train it for my Nita Ran? No. The fuck? The hell? Why would I do that? Why would I do that? That's dumb. It's counterproductive. I'm just trading one gender for the next gender. What? Alright, whoa, whoa. What am I doing? What am I doing? Alright, let's talk to you. Let's see what you got. People often lose things in the underground dark in the darkness of the underground path. Interesting, really? Hmm. Alright, so here we are on Route 6. And our Route 6 encounter is. Uh, what is this? What is, what is, uh, what is going on today? Um, that's a big boy. We got eight balls left. Um, wow. Uh, just, uh, wow. All right. All right, he did. Okay. Big boy coming through. Um, yeah. And it's a wall, so I guess I could take. Let's take down it. Don't kill. Don't kill. Don't kill. Oh my God! All right. All right. Now it makes me. And now it makes. Wait, no, it's a steel type as well. So we can go for a metal claw. We can also go for a metal claw. And all right. Oh my God, that that's scary. All right, it went for Harden. I'm not risking it. I am not risking it. I no. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus Almighty. Thank you, God. Oh, my God. I legit did not mean to do that. I meant to hit takedown. I meant to hit takedown. Oh, my God. We just got a low roll right there. We literally just got a low roll right there. Because there is no... Oh, my God. That would have been so scary. I would have been so pissed. I would have been so pissed. I just threw that... I just accidentally hit Metal Claw. I was not trying to do that whatsoever. Two. Oh my god. I just needed you to shake one more time and get in the Pokeball. I just needed you to shake one more time. Come on. Come on. One, two, three. Fuck. It's a pseudo, though. It's. No, it's not. What the fuck? It's not a pseudo. Is it a pseudo? No, it's not a pseudo. It's just a normal one. It's just a normal one. But that's bulk. That's a wall right there. That is a wall right there. That'll be two walls. Two powerful mods that we just caught today. And they're both in the PC. Let's fucking go. We got Aaron on the team now. We got Aaron on the team now. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. We've seen their entire evolutionary line. We've seen their entire evolutionary line. A-A-R-O-N. Let's go. Aaron the Agron. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Yo, I want to avoid trainers right now. Low key wanna avoid trainers. What else could we have gotten? We could have got him a champ. We could have also got a Justin. We also could have got a Justin, bro. Bro, what the hell are these routes? What the hell are these routes right now? Yo, as long as we don't run into straight up utter trash. Oh, we gotta battle them. We have to battle them. Shit. Alright, let's heal. Let's heal up our mods real quick. Does anybody need healing? Raise your hand if you need healing. Raise your hand if you need healing. Metagross definitely needed healing. Alright, let's get ready to take him on. Let's fucking go. 
Oh, we take them on one on one. All right. All right, that's cool. Cool beans, cool beans. You have three mons in a fucking shell gone. Why? Why? Why do you have a pseudo? Explain. Explain. How did you get a pseudo? Alright, this is kind of bad. This is kind of bad. We get the flinch. We outspeed. Good shit. Down goes the Shogun. We weren't fully healed, so if that thing would have went for anything, that would have been super effective against us. Why? Why? No, stay in, because Bite will kill this thing. Bite will kill this thing. Why? Why? You make the second you say you make the second trainer in these past two episodes that has had a Latios. Why? Where's your brother? Where's Latios? Where's your brother? Come on. Wait, what the hell is this? What the hell is this? Come on. Down goes the Latios. Natsu getting that experience. A Pichu. Pichu P. Let's switch out. Let's go out to Sleepy B. Actually, we probably could have switched out to Manny. Probably could have switched out to Manny because there's nothing this uh, Pichu can do to us. But I don't want to risk it at the same time. Do not want to risk it at the same time. It's a level 16 to Pikachu. Or Pichu. Is that Pikachu? Pichu. Definitely don't want to risk it whatsoever. Pichu goes for the cute charm, lowering our attack harshly. Unfortunately, we're not going for physical moves. We're going for special moves. So you're definitely going down. Ember for the KO. Down goes the Pichu. Down goes the Pichu indeed. All right, so we got to take on this last trainer right here. We got to take on this last guy right here, and then we're done. We're free to go. We're in Saffron City, boys. Saffron City, and we're home free. Let's freaking go. Mawile. Pfft. We can easily buy this thing. It's a steel dark type. Um, but I don't want to take the risk. So let's go ahead and heal up. Let's go ahead and heal up, not switch out. Let's go ahead, use the super potion on Natsu. See what this Mawile has. It has sweet scent. Which is kind of bad, low-key. Low-key kind of bad. Let's go for Ember. This should be a one-hit KO, though. Bam, that was all she wrote for this Mawile. What else you got? What you got next? Croconaut, bro. Bro, chill. Like, for reals? Chill the fuck out? Gazio's about to get to level 21. He's hungry. He's out for blood. He's out for blood right now. He's legit out for blood. He goes for the Metal Claw. Oh, it doesn't do nearly enough like I thought it would. He goes for the scratch, however. We're going to go for the confusion. No, 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 no. Let's not. Let's not. Let's not. Because I think Croconaw's a water dark type. Is that this gen? Or is it just pure water? Is that this gen? I'm pretty positive it's water dark type right now. I'm pretty positive. I could be thinking about a whole nother mod. Could be thinking about a whole nother mod. But I'm pretty positive I'm thinking about the right mod. Gazoo gets 489 experience, leveling him up to 21. Let's freaking go. Down goes this trainer. And now we're home free, guys. We're home free. Vermil Vermilion City. I said Saffron earlier. I said Saffron earlier. Vermilion City. There we go. Let's heal up our team. And get ready to get these mods. We got to get this rod. We got to get the old rod first. And then we can get ourselves a Vermilion City encounter. We can get ourselves a Diglett's Cave encounter. And we can get ourselves a Route 7 encounter. I believe is this house is this house yes it is I am the fishing guru there we go we get the old rod and now let's go ahead register the old rod and go ahead and get ourselves a million city encounter and our Vermilion City encounter is... It's Igneal. It's fucking Igneal. Yo! It's level 5. It's level fucking 5. What do we have? What do we have? Who can we go out to? We can go out to Manny, or we can go out to Wisher. Let's go out to Wisher. I feel more comfortable going out to Wisher because Wisher can heal himself. Bite. 
Alright, chill. Confusion. You're three levels above it. Don't kill it. God damn it, Wisher! Fuck. Alright, I need to keep track of these. I need to keep track of these. Alright. So, our Route 5 encounter was a Swampert who we named JD. Our Route 6 encounter was an Agron that we named Aaron. And then our Vermilion City. I'm on that route to Vermilion City. Vermilion City encounter was a Bagon who we killed. Bam. Alright. So next up, we have... Actually, we can also get ourselves a SSN encounter. So that makes four more encounter. That makes three more encounters that we can get. We can get a Route 11 encounter. I said Route 7, and I meant 11. Alright. So, our Diglett Cave encounter is going to be... If we can run into one. Diglett's Cave is a Crobat. Or a Gobat, sorry. Diglett's Cave. Go... Bat. Alright, and I don't know what we're going to name this Gold Bat. Do not know what we're going to name this Gold Bat. Do I even... Well, I want to catch it just so we have... Um, oh, we need to go buy Pokeballs before we go to Route 11. We need to buy Pokeballs. Um, I don't know what to name this Gold Bat. Uh, I guess we can call it Bat Girl. Because it is a female. You know, be uncliche about it. You know, be unoriginal. One. Alright, so we gotta weaken it down. I don't know how we're gonna weaken it down, however. Um, I guess we can go out to Sleepy B, because Sleepy B is like level 16. I almost made the same mistake I made back in Mount Moon. Let's go out to uh, Sleepy B. He's level 15. He went for the bite, which did a decent amount of damage to us. That did a lot, actually. Let's go for Ember. Astonish. Okay, we're eating it up. Good shit. Alright. Nope. We gotta switch back out. Let's we'll switch out to Gazio. We'll switch out to Gazio and then go for a poke another Pokeball. Let's go for another Pokeball right here. Come on. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. All right, we're down to our last Pokeball, guys. Um, I guess I could go for a Metal Claw, and if it kills, it kills. But we are confused, however. We are confused, and I don't want to throw this last Pokeball without at least trying to get it into the red. All right, that's going to that's as best as we can do. No! Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Thank you, Jesus. Oh my god. Oh my god, I keep doing that. I keep doing that. I need to I need to pay more attention. Alright. Last Pokeball to the Golbat. It's in the yellow, deep in the yellow, borderline red. One, two, three. Alright, we get it. I think we're just gonna name it Batgirl. Just because I, I can't come up with another name. So we get the we get the Golbat. And we're gonna nickname it Batgirl. Actually, it's all one word, isn't it? It's all one word. Bat girl. That's definitely not how you spell girl. Alright, G I R L. Bam. Alright, so now we got Bat Girl in the PC. Alright, now let's go run, get ourselves some Pokeballs, and then come back to Route uh, 11. Get ourselves an encounter there. Get ourselves an SSN encounter, and then in the next episode, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take on. I'm past. I like completely walk past the Pokemon, uh, Pokemart. But in the next episode, what we're gonna do is we're going to take on the SSN and get cut and battle our rival for the third time. 
So let's go ahead and buy some Pokeballs real quick. How many do we want to buy? I think we're going to buy 25. I think that's a decent amount. I think that's a decent amount right there. Now let's come over here. Let's come back over here all the way into Route 11. Battle this trainer real quick. I wasn't trying to battle him anyway. But I guess we can go ahead and battle him. How many Pokemon do you have, bro? You just have one. That's cool. A Meganium. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Interesting. Let's go for the Ember. It's level 21 as well. Yo. Poison Powder. Come on with this. I'm so glad we pulled out Antidotes. I'm so glad we bought Antidotes. Extremely excited that we did that. Alright. Down goes the Meganium. One hit. Are you kidding me? But we get the Burn Off. So it might die right now after after this attack right here. We're definitely going to live this poison. <laughs> We're definitely going to live the poison. It's a good thing we have those antidotes. Is it going to live? No, it does not. It dies. That's all she wrote for this trainer. Natsu gets to level 25. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Alright, we're learning takedown. Let's get rid of Leer for it. Alright, so we learned takedown, which is good, which is gonna probably come in handy because of stab. Um, let's first off heal up Super Potion. Super Potion. And then we gotta use a Super Potion on Manny. Alright. And now we use an antidote. Nope, wrong thing. Antidote on Natsu. Bam, and we're golden. We're golden. We picked up this master ball real quick. Leftovers, that can come in handy. Alright. So our route 11 encounter is a ah! Loxus! Lady Loxus! Yo! No, I gotta name it Kaminari. Even though it's a female, I gotta name it Kaminari. I have to name it Kaminari. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Shout out to My Hero Academia. Alright, come on. Alright, I see I'm gonna have to speed this up. I'm gonna see. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm sorry about that, guys. I accidentally minimized the game. Let's do this. Go for the takedown. Alright, we're good. We're good. We're golden. Alright. Let's heal up. Let's heal up real quick. Super potion on Natsu. No, don't attack. Just throw a Pokeball. Bam. And there we go. We got Kaminari in the PC. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Kaminari. Okay, Google. My Hero Academia Kaminari. K A M I N A R Y. Alright, bam. We're golden. We are golden. Alright, now let's come back up here and get ourselves a SSN encounter. Alright, can we not get one right now? Okay, we can't get one right now. But I'm going to end the episode right here. In the next episode, we're going to take on the SSN, all the trainers in there, battle our rival, and get cut so we can take on Lieutenant Surge. So, if you guys enjoyed this hour of power and are excited for tomorrow's episode, be sure to fire punch that like button because it's greatly appreciated. And if you're new to my channel, be sure to hit the, bell, uh, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below if you want to become a fire puncher yourself. 
Also, I upload videos every Monday through Friday, and I go live on this channel every Thursday and Friday as well. So if you want to be notified whenever I go live or whenever I upload a video, be sure to hit the bell icon right there beside the subscribe button. And with that said, share this video with your family and friends. I am the infamous front ape. Back at, well, I am the infamous front ape. And remember to be infamous in everything you do. And I'll see you guys. Really? Really? While I'm trying to do the outro. While I'm trying to do my outro. Can you leave? Can you leave? Rude people. Come on. Alright, are you going? Are you going? You're driving pretty damn slow. Thank you. I am the infamous front ape, and remember to be infamous in everything you do. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace! Now the fade away.